uh, the uh, reports have come out and we've been covering them and everybody's been and I spoke to the parents of an incredible young lady and you you saw her the other day you saw what happened the other day in Georgia and the parents are devastated they're incredible people but this is a Joe Biden invasion this is a Biden invasion over the past three years I call him crooked Joe because he's crooked he's a terrible president the worst president our country's ever had uh, probably the most incompetent president we've ever had. But it's uh, allowing thousands and thousands of people to come in from China, Iran, Yemen, the Congo, Syria, and a lot of other nations. Many nations are not very friendly to us. He's transported the entire columns of uh, fighting aged men, and they're all at a certain age. And you look at them and they say, they, they look like warriors to me. Something's going on. It's bad. Now the United States is being overrun by the Biden migrant crime. It's a new form of uh, vicious violation to our country. It's migrant crime. We call it Biden migrant crime, but that's a little bit long. So we'll just leave it. But every time you hear the term migrant crime, you know where that comes from. Allowing thousands and thousands and actually millions and millions of people to come. Could be 15 million, could be 18 million by the time he uh, gets out of office because the excerpt from Donald Trump's discourse revolves around immigration under the Joe Biden administration. The emphasis on terms like invasion and migrant crime implies a Democratic perspective critical of President Joe Biden's immigration policies. Donald Trump claims that Joe Biden, or Crooked Joe as he labels him, is permitting the entry of thousands, including those unfriendly to the U.S., stirring public sentiment. References to fighting aged men and insinuations of something bad occurring amplify public apprehension about potential threats tied to border security and unchecked immigration. The phrase Biden mutant crime appears as an attempt to attribute perceived border issues to the Joe Biden administration. Sympathy arises for Trump's assertion that the U.S. is overrun, serving as a critique of lenient immigration policies. The public interprets these remarks as a censure of Joe Biden's immigration strategies voicing concerns about security risks and characterizing the scenario as a manifestation of migrant crime.